What's up guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode. So today I'm with my sister Denny. What's up Denny? And we are going, and this is a kind of a creek behind our house. And whenever it rains a lot, this whole thing floods. There's a couple like deep, deep pockets where sometimes it holds some fish. So we're gonna go and try and catch some fish. We have some rods, but we also have a blow gun. We're gonna try and pull a Tim Wells here. And I looked it up and it is legal to fish for bluegill slash sunfish. So we're gonna see, or to bow fish. So we're gonna see if we can dart one of these bluegills. So it'll be, it should be interesting. So we're walking up and I see that branch move. I'm like, look at it then on that branch. Well, there's a snake on that branch. Holy cow. Yep, let's move past that one. We're safely out of harm's way of that snake now, but if you're wondering why there's broken sunglasses on my head, well, somebody stepped on them, but they're polarized. I mean, this water is pretty clear, but I was thinking, you know, the polar vision you can get. So we're rigging up here. I'll show you what we got going. All right, so right here on this rod, we have, I just got a little bitty white jig right there. All right, now I'm gonna pair that jig with this little white grub here, so you can see. I think that'll work good because I think I think these fish are still there. Now that no food source in here, here show them the show them the pond. It's a little puddle. Yeah, it's just a little bitty thing. Under a bridge. The whole thing's getting some sunstripes over it apparently. Yeah, there's a slide. Okay, so I'm just gonna put this little grub. I'm just gonna put this little grub on here. Just like that. Not the greatest rig up, but it's okay. So just, I'm just gonna be dangling on that in there. And then my sister, Danny, is going to be fishing with just a worm and a hook here. Just a normal old worm and a bobber. So we're gonna go live bait versus our official bait. I'm sure the live bait will do better, but I wanna catch my own artificial bait. And then after that, we have this puppy. So we forgot to bring duct tape, because we're smart, but so this is a blow gun bow into it. But what we have here, there's a little fishing reel we took off of one of our spin cast rods. So it's pink, you know, great, great color. But this is the tip. I think we probably need a bigger tip than that, but this is all we had. So basically what's gonna happen is we're gonna put the dart in this side of the blowgun and then leave the bail open on this reel and see if we can shoot one. It, it'll definitely gonna be pretty hard, but I think we can get it done. So let's do it. All right, ready? Hold on, ready? Set, go. Oh. Get, Denny, he got it. Oh, I think it's, oh, they're playing with it. Okay, I can't get this thing in the water. Okay, so th they all just probably it stole her worm. I think it spit. <laughs> They all go to the person that threw in the water first. I think they're scared of us, Denny. Mm -hmm. Okay, they're going towards me now. Oh, got him. Oh, he came out. He came out. Oh, I had him. I had him. I had him. I know it doesn't count, Denny. That's a big bluegill right there. Oh, he spit it out. Got him, I got him. No way, no way. Come on, yes sir. <laughs> I got him. I get, no way, I think that's a green sunfish. No way, I caught that. That's crazy. I don't think we're gonna be able to catch him down here. It's just, it's just, nice toss. <laughs> this is just a tiny, tiny little creek. And I just caught a sunfish. That's crazy. No way, that's crazy. I think that's a green sunfish. Comment below and let me know if I'm mistaken, but that's crazy. Just out here on that little grub, not a bad size, you know. Its mouth is huge, its mouth is like a bass. So I think that's where the green sunfish is. It has a big mouth like a bass. All right, let's let this guy go. That's awesome. Oh, there he goes, he is good to go. Yes, mission accomplished. Let's go, give me some up here, up here, up top, up high. You're running away from me. All right, so Danny's gonna go over there and try and shoot one with a blowgun. And I'm gonna try and catch one again. Oh, 
Oh, that one was too tiny. These are fish are way too tiny. Oh, he spit it out. They're all they're all playing with it. They're, well, I, you guys can't see how many tiny ones there are. Oh, that's a big one. Got him, got him. Another fish, another fish. <laughs> no, Denny. <laughs> Let's go. That, we're gonna say it's not. No, this one's a little smaller. No way. First fish, no, second fish. Look how pretty this guy's fins are. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. Sweet, second fish. Awesome. I still can't believe we're catching them out. They must just be so hungry. All right, see you, dude. There he goes, back to his home where I can still see him. All right, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to put the GoPro underwater for you guys and see if I can get it casted right by there so you guys can see what the fish are doing under there. All right, you guys are going in the waterproof case where the audio sucks. So I'm not gonna be able to talk to you very much, but I'm gonna put you underwater with the fish to see if you can get up close. All right, you guys are going underwater now. Alright folks, that is going to be a wrap on today. It was a fun day, we caught... Well, ripped the GoPro battery. But anyways, as I was saying, we caught a couple bluegill, three, I, I th no, four. I caught three, Danny caught one. But it was a fun adventure. I'm sorry I didn't show you guys much of the blowgun fishing. I don't know, something with my footage got messed up and it was weird. But we blowgun fished, we found out the blowgun didn't have enough penetration to actually go under the water anyways. But anyways, it was a fun day. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. We're going on another fun adventure today. So new video coming soon after this one. Hope you guys enjoyed this. And I hope you're staying safe. And I'll see you later.